Hey guys, welcome to another video. In today's video, we're going to be talking about Critter Crops. So I do have the unfortunate news, the game is getting pushed back and delayed. So the original April 15th release date is not going to be able to get met. So before we get our pitchforks and say, oh, this game's done, oh, blah, blah, blah. Let, let, let's, before we start doing that, let's give the devs some credibility here. They did actually give us a... Uh, Kind of an apology uh, notice on Twitter. So it looks like the publisher actually did us a solid favor this time. And they actually found some stuff during the QA sweep. Which honestly, that, that's a really good sign. And a bad sign at the same time. But honestly, I would rather have that QA team discover the issues before the game gets fully launched. But yeah, let's read this letter here. Dearest friends, supporters, and Critter COVID. We come bearing sad news. We know a lot of excitement has been stirring since the release date announcement for Critter Crops. Unfortunately, we are no longer confident in that date and will be postponing the release of the game to later this year. Honestly, I, I, I'm okay with this. At least they're being transparent about it. I, I do wish it was a little sooner, but it's, it's really hard when it comes to, you know, finding a release date and sticking to it but yeah let's continue on here. this is a very difficult time for us our dev is heartbroken and struggling with things going this way as she spent many sleepless nights long weekends and time away from family trying to ensure launch happened on time rest assured the game is coming as soon as our publisher gets through their qa sweeps and we all conclude a few playthroughs of the game which is a bit more lengthy than expected. Honestly, that's good QA testing. We'll go through the game multiple times and go different paths. So I, I'm, I'm, you know, not shocked. You know, sometimes you go through the playthrough of one game one time, and then you decide to go slightly different. You might find something new. So it, it that's, you know, the signs of a good, you know, QA and a quality process. I, I'm not, you know, I'm not like I'm disappointed April 15th getting missed, but honestly, I would rather get all these bugs. I, I, I would rather see a more polished product in game at the very end. I, I wouldn't even mind that the game got delayed six more months. As long as the product in the in the long run gets a clean polish, nice playthrough, like I, I, I'm completely happy as long as the devs are transparent which they're definitely being transparent here i don't have any issues with this let's see uh let's do 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 which is a bit more lengthy than expected and agree that the game is in its best state and gets the final green light you will be notified as soon as possible of the new launch date so i'm suspecting they probably found something that was kind of game like game broken here and they just need a little bit more time. Again, we apologize and we know this isn't what anyone wants to hear, but our team believes in quality. I completely agree with that. The last thing we want is a murky launch for our very first game and on an IP we hope and believe could transcend this one title. We are forever grateful for your patience and encouragement during this time. We truly apologize. Please be kind with love, Team Skyreach. Honestly, guys, I, I'm I'm completely okay with this. Obviously, don't don't be going out there, you know, hating. At least they're being transparent about it. I would rather see a polished product at the very end. As soon as we hear a date, you know, a release date. I will give you guys an update, but yeah, it is unfortunate news, but I'm not surprised. You know, unfortunately this is game development stuff happens and you know, this is part of the QA process. They might've found something that might've not, let's be honest, there could have been a thousand players and a good QA team, you know, will find something, you know, that could be game breaking. So I, I'm, I'm not surprised, but yeah, let me know down below how you guys feel about this. Other than that, I will see you guys in the next one. Take care. 